Where your dictionary inventory for the letter Q. Quod libertarian. One who talks and disputes on any subject. Uh, so I guess the, the pyramid design is okay, but the Q for the font is not the best. It's a bit elongated. I don't know, it's gonna be like that for everyone, I guess, because these are words starting with Q. It's gonna be a problem with every single one of these. Quisquillion, consisting of trash or rubbish, or this alternative, in it by extension probably, without value or importance. Insignificant. So I'd have the visual of garbage, trash, and then you can have this by extension definition, most likely, without value or importance, insignificant. It could be the reverse, actually, but I think it originates with garbage, but I'm not certain. I could always look it up, but I'm not. <laughs> I'm not even gonna bother. Oh, here's the better quietism. Quietism, a form of mysticism involving quiet contemplation. Everybody shut up! Oh, no, this would be good in a D&D &D campaign. You just, like, your character out of nowhere is, Everybody shut up! And then you use your quiet contemplation strategy, and the enemy's poking you in the head, and they're trying to, you know, break your focus, you're in the trance. Mm. Everybody guard me and keep the monster quiet while I do my quiet contemplation to do my mysticism, my magic. How would you, I guess you'd be a physical spell activation, because if it's verbal, you ruin your quietism, right? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Interesting concepts for D&D. You could probably play that off, do some role play. I gotta learn how to do the role play bit of D&D. I just play it very mechanically when I play D&D. Roll dice, my character does this, no acting involved. I'm pretty bad at that. Oh my gosh, too close to the cues. Queer baiting, the practice of creating homoerotic tension between two characters in a narrative work without the intention of ever developing it into an actual same-sex relationship or explicitly addressing the question of either character's sexuality. Qualifile, a cognitive scientist who endorses qualia as being unmeasurable by Pedro Fino Phenology. Mm. Yes, I understood that. <laughs> uh. Bum 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 bum.